The last few days have been a real roller coaster of emotion. And I want to start by paying tribute to Nicola Sturgeon. She has been an incredible party leader and an exceptional First Minister. Thank you, Nicola, for all that you have done for Scotland. I've thought hard about it, and I've decided to put myself forward as Scotland's next First Minister. I'm doing it because the top job requires somebody who has experience, and I have been trusted by Nicola Sturgeon with some of the toughest jobs in government, as Transport Minister, as Justice Secretary, and now entrusted to steer our NHS through its recovery from the global pandemic. But I'm also doing it because I believe in independence with every fibre of my being. I believe independence is needed now more than ever before, particularly after a decade of austerity. Now, our opponents are desperate to talk about process. I want us to talk about policy. I want us to build and grow our movement from the grassroots upwards. I'm also putting myself forward because, let's be honest, there is far too much division in our society. There's far too much division in our political discourse. And I believe I have the skills to reach across the divide and bring people together, be that in our own party, that ought indeed across the country. So please get in touch with me to, if you have questions, if you want to hear more about the campaign. But I hope you'll also support me as Scotland's next First Minister.